Welcome to Smoke Signals, a hard-hitting news program for students, by students. I'm Haley. And welcome to Smoke Signals. First, we take it off to Tyler with student interviews. All right, so I'm here with Kale. And today, I'm going to ask him who's performing at the Super Bowl halftime show. Take it away. Adele and Taylor Swift. Thanks. And I'm here with the other Tyler. And I'll be asking him who has the most Super Bowl rings. Barack Obama. How many? He's wrong. It's Tom Brady with seven. But thanks anyway for joining. All right. So I'm here with Nancy. Who has never been to the Super Bowl? The Miami Dolphins. Wrong. The answers are the Browns, the Detroit Lions, the Texans, and the Jaguars. And now I'm going to ask Morgan who's in this year's Super Bowl. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe All right, now I'm here with Luke, and I'll be asking him who is going to the Super Bowl. Cowboys and the Jets. Close, but still wrong, like everybody else has been this week. It is the Bengals. Thank you, Tyler. And now we're going to Riley, who's at recess. I'm Riley, and I'm in the gym. This is Z. What is your Valentine box going to look like this year? An adorable shoebox. Nice. This is Landon. What is your box going to look like this year? Baby Yoda. Nice. This is Tucker. What's your Valentine box going to look like this year? The treasure chest. What's in the treasure chest? Gold. Wow. I'm Riley, and I'm at recess. Today, we're asking what your favorite Valentine box is. Ready? I'm briefly and a French football. I'm Lincoln and I'm doing a NASCAR. I'm Thomas and I'm doing a car. I'm Chris and I'm going to do a Disney theme. I'm Chris and I'm going to do a Disney theme. I'm Tucker and I'm going to do a treasure chest. I'm Malia and I'm just going to have a bunch of parts on it. I'm Kelly and I'm going to do a Disney theme. Thank you. This is Raquel. What are you going to do on Valentine's Day? I'm going to send my friends Valentine's. Do you have a lot of friends? Not really. Thank you. Thank you, Riley. And now we go to Bo with Bo Knows. All right, I'm Bo, and this week we're going to be interviewing seventh graders like we did last week with the sixth graders. Tell us your name. Josiah. And tell us something interesting about yourself. I like to make fun of my brother. All right, thank you. Tell us your name. Brody. And tell us something interesting about yourself. I can break my arms. That's so weird. All right, tell us your name. 
<laughs> I'm Bella, and I have seven animals. That's not enough. You need more. <laughs> All right, what's your name? Grace. And tell us something interesting about yourself. Last year, I jumped off a golf cart and broke my wrist. Back at it again with the golf cart. All right, tell us your names. Um, I'm Bailey slash Little Brooklyn. Danny. Um, and we're two out of three of the girls that wrestle for junior high. <laughs> so right, tell us your name. Cambry. And tell us something about yourself. I'm Carson's sister. Not something to brag about. Okay, tell us your name. Danica. And tell us something about yourself. I have straight A's. A lot better than I'm What's doing. What's your name? Delaney. And tell us something about yourself. I have to be cousins with Lincoln. Nice. All right, tell us your name. I'm Felicity, and I have a pet lizard named Samuel L. Jackson. That's so cool. Samuel Jackson. <laughs> Alrighty, tell us your name. Uh, Desi. And tell us something about yourself. I like to draw. I like to, but I'm not very good at it. Alrighty, tell us your name. Beth. And tell us something about yourself. I'm addicted to my phone. Aren't we all? Alrighty, tell us your name. Chase. Tell us something about yourself. I love basketball. I hate basketball because I'm a wrestler. Alright, tell us your name. Aiden. Tell us something about yourself. That I have seven dogs. Seven? It's a lot. Alright, tell us your name. Finn. And tell us something about yourself. I got a piece of barbed wire stuck in my foot at Mazingo. Ouch. Alrighty, tell us your name. Dalton. Tell us something about yourself. My favorite movie is Revenge of the Sith. I'm more of a Attack of the Clones kind of guy, but whatever. Tell us your name. Dean. Tell us something about yourself. I wrestle. So do I. Okay, upon further inspection, as they get older, the number of golf cart accidents drastically drops. So, back to you in the studio. Thanks, Bo. That was very no. And now we go on to Sophia, who's taken us on the FBLA field trip to the roastery. We just arrived. Um, we didn't go to Chateau this year, but... That bus ride was very cold. There's Chateau Milk in that it's, it's area. It's really cold. It is really cold, but this place is very... Say that again. The coffee tree is planted, and it takes five years to reach maturity. Hey. We got a sample of coffee. It's hot. When you think about what coffee is, we have to think about, about it, both from the consumer and producer. Coffee. Mm. So we're going into the actual roastery room. It can get It's a lot of beans. Bobby. Connects to that tube, which will suck up the coffee into the top half. It will get sucked up into this filter, uh, which is called a deep stoner. It just removes any rocks, squares, or. Chorizo burrito, and it's pretty good. I give it a eight out of ten. I got a plain bagel. It's plain. Seven out of ten. <laughs> oh, plain. Daniel still has his internet on. Getting ready to leave. Go get food. Where are we gonna go? I've had a fun day, and we don't know where we're going. We want to go to Saint John. There's Bo. Beans. <laughs> you and we'll end with that. On a coffee today, Kenna. My heart's gonna explode. <laughs> That's not good. I've had four and I don't, I feel fine. I haven't had a lot and I'm already not feeling too good. You're my stomach. Hey, were you guys listening down the seat? <laughs> Counselors gonna ask him a couple questions. Um, what is High School Counselors Week? Um, 
National School Counseling Week happens the first full week of February every year, and it's a week that gives us an opportunity to advocate for our role and teach others about what we do. Um, if you've noticed the candy in the hallway, it's also a chance for us to celebrate and thank everyone who helps make our job better and easier. That includes students. Um, what's your guys' favorite part about counseling? Um, uh, my favorite part is seeing you kids when you cross the stage for your awards and more importantly, your diploma, and that you've completed your task at hand, and and your smiling faces every day. Yep, I enjoy the relationships that are formed, um, no matter how long it takes, um, just getting to connect with students, and through their good and bad. Um, what's your favorite part about being able to work together? Oh, well... I I don't have all the weight on my shoulders now, like, you know. Um, we can divide and conquer, and I think more kids, more of you can have more accessibility to mm -hmm. the two of us, and um, yeah. We can, we can laugh through that. Yes, life. yes, she does make me laugh. Yeah. Well, she does make me laugh. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank yeah. you. This is front door service. This is what happens when you order ahead. Only special people get this treatment. That <laughs> is awesome. Thank you, Lambo. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Soap. And now we go to the Winter Olympics with cast and crew. Hello, this is Smoke Signal's take on the Winter Olympics. The Winter Olympics are actually taking place in Beijing, China. The only problem is they don't have snow. So they're making their own snow, made in China. Well, anyway, we're all gonna talk about our favorite Olympic sports. Mine, curling. The reason I like curling is 50 year old men could compete in the Olympics in an event. It's really cool. Check out the guy in the mullet, much CTV. Let's go to the rest of the game. My favorite Olympic sport is hockey. You know, I went to a fight and a hockey game broke out. My favorite winter sport is ski jumping. Mr. Jeter, what is your favorite winter Olympic sport? I enjoy the biathlon. I think it's impressive that they can uh, cross-country ski that far and then shoot accurately. It's cool. My favorite Olympic sport is luge. Oh. My favorite winter sport is pickleball. Hey, Seth, pickleball isn't a winter Olympic sport. It's actually not an Olympic sport at all. Oh. My favorite winter sport is bobsled. Hi, I'm Sophia, and my favorite Olympic sport is snowboarding. Yes! Go. My favorite Winter Olympic sport is speed skating. Go. My favorite Olympic sport is figure skating because I like the costumes. We didn't have any ice, so we're gonna make do. Judges. That Russian was the judge. greatest thing I've ever seen. Thanks, smoke signals. And now we take it to Aaron, who's doing Wolfpack sports. Take it away, Aaron. What's up, Wolfpack? This is Aaron with your week in Wolfpack sports. The girls basketball team is now 12 and 11. After a win over Mount City, but two straight losses, they hope to get back on track tonight against North Nottoway. The boys are now 9 and 14. With two tough losses in a row, they got back on track Wednesday night against the Cap.
I'm here with Coach Aaron Barons and star running back Kalen Merriweather of the East Atchison Wolves, who just recently, just now, signed his letter of intent to play football at William Jewell College in Liberty, Missouri. First, Coach Barons, tell us a little bit about Kalen and, and what this signing means to you. Uh, Kalen started for us for four years, uh, worked his butt off, and this was kind of something that early on in, in his life, him and I had talked about um, and kind of what his goals were and to see him get there and um, you know this was kind of really the only school he looked at and so for him to kind of set his sights on that and get it is really exciting and rewarding not not just for for him but for me and uh, you know the Wolves family we're really excited for him. Kalen what does this mean to you? Uh, I'm really excited right now I can't wait to get down there and put in some work. Thank you very much. Hi, I'm Aaron of Wolfpack Sports here with Hanley, who just um, qualified for nationals in the Elks free throw shooting contest. Um, how many free throws did you shoot today? 25 to 50. That's a lot. Um, so, what's the next step in the competition for you? Um, I go to regionals March 11th to 13th, and if I win that, I go to nationals. Um, okay, and how much better are you than your brother? Way better. Alright, shoot. Tonight, the high school wrestlers go down to Midbuck to compete at districts. Lincoln and I receive third seeds, while the rest hope to fight their way through the back bracket. Go Wolves! Thank you, Aaron. And now we go to Seth versus. You got it, Seth. Go. <sighs> All right, who am I fighting first? Seth, this isn't WWE, this is actual wrestling. Well, what? I broke the belt. Take it off. It's ready to go, dude. P.S. That's right. Keep running. I don't know what that is. Keep running, boys. There it goes. What a dime! Get it in there! Yeah! Rock. Well, as you can see, my concept of wrestling and their concept of wrestling was a little off. You know, I, I, I do scripted things and do a lot cooler jumps, and they just kind of wallow around on the ground in spandex. But, hey, you know, I guess there's always a difference. Hey, Brooklyn, you, you, you okay? You know what? Right? Got a little bit of mushy brain, but all right. Ah, it's okay. Just, just freeze it. It'll... Strengthen up. All right, well, they have districts coming up soon, so they're gonna destroy and they're going to bring home the big wobbly title. Thank you, Seth. And now we're going to birthdays with us. Welcome to Birthday Corner. Happy birthday to Riley Leanne Leakey on Sunday the 13th, Shaylin Allerston McNaughton on Monday the 14th, Tyler Malcolm Donaldson on Tuesday the 15th and Gavin Lee Mattis on Thursday the 17th. Happy birthday! Thank you, us. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Thanks, Bo. That was very no. And now we go to, uh, not Riley, because I said that. Barons and star running back Kalen Merriweather of the East Atchison Wolves. Who, okay. Go. My favorite Olympic sport is I, I, I mentioned it's, winter sports. Uh, Josie, your eyelids are red. Explain yourself! The candy bed attacked me. <laughs> uh, okay, thanks. Um, we should totally start that over. Thanks, smoke signals. So, Bo taught me how to use chopsticks. My name's Casey Martin and I'm in Smoke Sick Now. Let's redo that. My favorite 
<laughs> Welcome to Birthday Corner. Happy birthday to Riley Leanne. Oh my god, I'm sorry. What's happening right now? He's on a bus. Is he on a bus? There is a police officer. I said right foot creep, oh, walking with that heat. Look around. Thank you, us. And thank you for watching. Nope, I did not like that. <laughs> I should have said something else. Thank mm -hmm. you.